Without a doubt, mining is a controversial undertaking nowadays. Given BX's continuous downward spiral, some began to doubt its rationale already in the summer. After all, the activity is energy-consuming, costly and not too rewarding. And yet the majority of players have not given up. On the contrary, it remains on their to-do list. Thus back in August, Bloomberg noted that with Bitcoin declining this year, you might expect mining activity to follow. That hasn't he happened. Indeed, the appetite for mining is still there. The question is how to satisfy it given the current bear market. What other coins apart from the holy trinity of PX, Ad and Arup are worth considering? And most importantly, which coins are currently the easiest to mine and how rewarding are they? Greater than greater than best Bitcoin mining pools less than less than painting the whole picture if you are new to the game, I feel like refreshing your memory, then before mining you need to ask yourself a couple of questions, how reliable is the coin? Has it been on the market long enough? What is its price? If it is a mining pool, are they offering good terms? What kind of CPU slash PCU are you using? How much electricity will the mining consume? The list is by no means exhaustive. But it is a good starting point, especially since staying safe in the crypto world is a must, thus always consider the reliability of a coin. If it looks dodgy, better stay away in the first place. Besides, before you start mining, you need to figure out how. For example, you could buy hardware miners sold by Kanan or Bitman. But for a regular crypto user, this is hardly an option, as the equipment is expensive and energy consuming. Mining via a pool is therefore a sounder option. However, it is not only important to choose a reliable one, but also such which has bearable fees and offers solid returns. Remember that the world of crypto is rampant with fraud so it of utmost importance to avoid pools like Hashflare. Some of the most reliable on the market include Slushpool and PoolBX.com. Choosing an optimal CPU slash Gichu is another notion to keep in mind. There are plenty of options on the market. Some of the most popular ones include AMD Ryzen 7 1800X, AMD Ryzen Threadripper 1950X, Intel Pentium G. Naturally, you also have to consider how much energy is consumed and assess whether you will able to fit the bill. A Chinese citizen Zhu Xinyua, for instance, dreamt so big that he went to jail for stealing electricity. So what to mine? If you feel like you're ready to whirl in a hurricane of altcoins, the next big step is to determine which ones are the most facile to mine. Be prepared that the list is not rigid. Different observers point at different coins which they believe are the easiest to mine. Some still believe that BX and ETH are a good option. Others name a variety of coins like Steam, ETH Classic, Peercoin, Namecoin, Novacoin, Feathercoin, Dash. Still, in this plethora of choices some coins are mentioned more than others. One of them is Litecoin which is often considered BXS copycat. Despite its close affiliation with the mother and father of all crypto, it has its own unique competitive advantage. Thus it takes about minutes to generate a block compared to BXS 10 minutes. Besides, it uses the script hash function from Tenebricks instead of Bitcoin as SHA-256 function. Currently, it rewards miners with 25 new Litecoins. You can read full post on CryptoFans. News, link available in text below.